I'm I'm curious. Is it? I've I've heard bookies and I've heard bookus. Is it? Is it bookus? It's bookus. Yes. Uh, bookus cookus. Okay. Bookus cookus. Okay. Good to know. Or, uh, I, have, I it's like not. I it's not them. book. It's it's boo. So bookus cookus. Bookus. Bookus cookus. Bookus cookus. Oh my Bukis, god. I'm gonna Bukis, get that. Bookus cookus. I'm gonna get that. Uh, so wrong. And uh, just to let you know, Mr. Priestab, you're still not streaming in the channel. Um, right, right, right. But it looks like we are going to be getting started right into this first game. We have Muskie over on, uh, it looks like uh, he's playing Leonardo, but that boy looked like Raphael with that skin. Uh, yeah, he's got the pole. Uh, he's been saying that his, uh, his, uh, oh, did I say Donnie? Leonardo? I meant Donatello. Yeah, Donatello. yeah my, my bad. Uh, I don't know. We, I thought we were back in Nazby 1 for a minute. Yeah, the, his Donatello, he's been doing all right with him. He's pretty happy with the character right now. I'm not surprised that we're seeing it. Um, if he struggles, then he might switch to the the LT Gray or any other character, but um, we'll probably be seeing him rock the Donnie, barring any uh, problems. Donnie's one of those characters that has a lot of uh, potential that we're starting to see tapped a little bit more, specifically with Ball. I mean, Ball, you can see him using it in kind of creative ways where you can throw it out you can just let it drop uh, you can angle it in certain areas uh, to get uh, more damage continue a combo and we're seeing musky pull that out we see um, him getting already some pretty great damage on the board having to use the slime cancel just to stop the momentum but he's already at 138 off stage that was a great ledge hog coming out from abs he's gonna get that stock only at 93 percent this is not a whole lot if you're reptar yeah, uh, Reptar, notoriously good at living for a long time, but he's also kind of a punchy bag. Like, you get, you get him to 200, but he gets to 200 pretty quickly if you uh, are able to keep the pressure on. So it's pretty back and forth. Sometimes Reptar will be up by, like, two stocks, and then all of a sudden those stocks are gone. This fight specifically, uh, this matchup for Reptar is pretty tough because one of the biggest things that heavies have a, have a hard time dealing with is range. And... Donnie, that's his whole identity. Like, that's a big stick. Yeah. That is a big-ass stick. And that big-ass stick is going to confirm that kill, specifically the ball in the stick. Yeah. Do it. Who will um, win, so... big dino or long stick? Big stick. Yeah, big, big dino or big stick? Uh, it means yeah. to be so seen. So you got it's... the big D. Actually, no, you got the big D and the, the, the bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> the BS or the big D. Yeah. Um, but as we can see, uh, it's... I wouldn't say so so much even. I mean, we see Musky at his last stock, but getting some great combos going. But as you mentioned, only at 115. Uh, this is not kill percent if you're Reptar. Now it's 156. Great slime cancel. Not going to do it, though. Goes for the ball. Great dodge from Abs. Tries to go for the spike, but barely air dodges in time. I'm not sure what he was going for with that slime cancel. I think he was trying to like trying to follow up, but just kind of missed the follow up there, like to get the aerial right, right. up strong. Gotcha. But it didn't look like so. But now we're at a dead even game. I mean, that was a really great combo string from Muskie, and that's one of the problems we mentioned in this fight is that Reptar just he's a punching bag. He gets like just juggled so easily, but it doesn't matter when you get thrown off to the side of the stage and spiked. That was a great clutch coming out from Abs. Kind of looked like that game was about to get away from him just barely, but he's able to clutch it out, move on to game number two with a win in hand. Busky, uh, that, I don't think he needs to switch off of Donatello. That was a really good showing from him. I just think uh, if he got caught right at the end and just one bad position, and that's all. That's all abs needed. Yeah, no, I, I think this is doable. I, I don't think Muskie should be switching characters. He should be thinking more. What kind of stage can I take Reptar to? Uh, I know Muskie is pretty notoriously uh, stageless reform, so to speak. Um, he's not the biggest fan of the stages, uh, so mm -hmm. it'll be interesting to see where he takes him. Um, but yeah, no, the, the Donnie looked like it, it had answers. It's just a, a matter of capitalizing on it and not letting Reptar run all over him. Um, he was down by about two stocks at the beginning of the game, and then he brought it back. Uh, so whatever he was doing then, just try and nail that down. I think the biggest thing Muskie can improve on there, we saw him just not spacing properly. So he was 
like we saw him constantly up in Ab's face, and the fact is with Donnie is you really don't need to do that. Like the idea of this character is you need to have a good concept of spacing, you need to be able to space your aerials properly, and I would just like to see him improve on this in game number two. It looks like we're staying to the same stage. Uh, this is a good stage for both characters. Uh, Donnie specifically likes smaller stages because it's harder to avoid his big aerials, uh, as well as just the, the big stick. So we're seeing the stage stay, but we can already see some a lot of damage go on to Muskie at 107 already. My question is why did, are we going back to this stage? Like, I guess um, because you want to kill Reptar off the bottom a lot of the time because he's so heavy. Um, but still, like, Reptar, I don't think is bad on this stage. The, the the platform moving out of the way, like, if you get caught without that platform, the down B is scary. Ooh. Yeah, that down, that, the down B is scary, but that, that foot is even scarier. Gonna slam him. Gonna finally get that stock. You know, Ab's only at 133 right now. Not a whole lot for Reptar. Good DI is gonna save him there. And uh, to answer your question though about the stage, uh, while it is true you want to be able to, you want to kill Reptar off the bottom. The thing is, is that Donnie, Donnie prefers really small stages. Has to use the slime cancel there in order to live. But oh no, Musky! I thought we, uh, he probably thought he was close enough to grab ledge, but unfortunately not gonna be able to grab it. Gonna lose that stock. He can't uh, afford pretty... doing that. Yeah, no, he can't. He's in a bad situation now. He needs to get this stock quick. And it looks like Musky is doing everything he can to get this stock quick. Goes for a pretty crazy play. Abs misreads that situation. Could have easily taken that stock from him. Tries to go for a really crazy slime cancel with the, the down strong, it looked like, but not gonna find it. Reptar's not dead yet, though. Not dead yet. And this is just such a bad position to be in if you're Musky. I mean, we can see he's getting some good damage and some good combos, but he's trading a lot with abs. And Reptar, especially when you're behind, it, he's not a character you want to be trading with ever because he just comes out on top in all these situations. Uh-oh, that's it, that's it. Yeah, so... A little bit, game two, bit more of a deficit than last game, to say the least. Yeah, so it, this is a uh, best of three, right? Yes, best of three. Okay, yeah, so Musky, uh, he's going to have to make some miracles happen, but... Abs is sitting at a, a full bar, about to be sitting at two full bars pretty quickly. I'm going to use that to slime cancel, get some damage on. Muskie does not have a jump. Gets the gets the strong there. Going to take that in a defiant 2-0. Game one was really close, but game two was, that was a lights out performance yeah. coming from Ab. Uh, Abs, excuse me. Not sure. Um, really. Not sure why he went back to Jellyfish. Like, if, I, I get that Muskie wanted to, um, you know, it was close game one. But I feel like there's better stages that you could have taken Reptar to than Jellyfish. 